We're at Formdale Viaduct, which is a six-band viaduct. Previously, it was made of wrought iron and cast iron and was a built timber deck. And the importance of it is that it was under strength. It had a prohibition on it for heavy vehicles. So as a remit from themselves, they've asked us to replace the bridge with a 120-year design bridge. We started on site here about six months ago. Once we had built ourselves away into site, we then had to divert all the watercourses, which was all done under flood defence consent. Uh, we then had the ability to build a piling platform uh, for when we started to build the substructure uh, of this work. We finished the installation of the viaduct over the weekend where we had a 76 hour possession. So within that time we had to demolish the existing viaduct and install the new one. That was all done uh, within the timescales that we set, uh, so that was a good success for the project. Setting up the coordinates, setting up site at the start was very tricky because there's no surrounding structures, there was nothing continuity wise to set the site up on. So getting that right at the start and maintaining a decent setup on the instruments was tricky throughout. We did a pretty good job, I mean it's in there now and it's, it's good enough to have a train run over it, so we're pretty happy. We have good relationships with the Network Rail team. Uh, we have uh, several of their construction managers on site at different parts of the week, uh, regular meetings with the project managers, uh, so we keep them updated with the work we're doing here. They've been absolutely superb, from the design team all the way through to the guys on the ground down here. and It just seems to be an all-round team effort to actually get this job in and get it done successfully and get it done well and I think they had a lot of pride in their job.